Hi everyone, today's headlines. Economic blocker in Nagaland from today. Nagaland COVID-19 tally breaches 10,000 mark. One more death in Kohima. NSCN IM on Z plus security by Government of India to its leadership. Bharat Biotech Covaxin under Phase 3 trials. Scientists sound warning on UK mass testing. SpaceX rocket launches four astronauts to space station. Two NSCN K Nikki Sumi cadres apprehended in Purnabazar, Dimapur. DIPR sealed for 48 hours from Monday. News in details. Economic blockade in Nagaland from today. While the economic blockade in Nagaland called by various Kirby Anglong based civil society organizations including Kirby Students Association will begin from November 17. Another blockade was imposed along Jorhat Mogajong border areas on Monday, but was later lifted by evening. Though there were no toward incidents, tension continued to persist in the border district of Mogajong. Nagaland COVID-19 tally breaches 10,000 mark, one more death in Kohima. Nagaland COVID-19 tally breached 10,000 mark after 140 new positive cases were reported on Monday. The tally as of November 16 stood at 10,025 cases. Meanwhile, one more COVID death was reported from Kohima, taking the total death toll to 57. According to Health Department data, 47 deaths were COVID-related, 6 deaths not COVID-related, while 4 deaths were still under investigation. NSCN IM on Z plus security by Government of India to its leadership. Drawing attention to comparison made by WC and NPGs over the issue of Z plus category security provided by the Government of India, top leadership of NSCN IM, the MIP said, This arose because of New Delhi's seriousness of dealing its leaders who had arrived New Delhi at Sender's invitation to carry forward the Naga political talks and therefore drawing any comparison with superfluous. Bharat Biotech Covaxin enter Phase 3 trials. COVID-19 vaccine Covaxin being developed by Bharat Biotech is now undergoing Phase 3 trials, Krishna Ella, Chairman and Managing Director, Bharat Biotech said on Monday. Speaking virtually at a program organized by the Indian School of Business, Ella said, the company is also working on another vaccine for COVID-19, which would be in the form of nasal drops and can be ready by next year. We partnered with ICMR for COVID-19 vaccine as we speak it entered the phase 3 trials, he said. Parath Biotech is the only vaccine company in the world which has BSL-3 production facility, he said. Scientists sound warning on UK mass testing. British Prime Minister Boris Johnson plans for mass COVID-19 testing that might reopen large parts of economy, known as operational moonshot are likely to be ineffective and expensive, scientists concerned about the scheme said on Monday. The scientists said that the government's plans signaled a change in strategy from the test and trace scheme that has been plagued by difficulties, but that screening the general population regularly would throw up new problems. The evidence for screening is not there. The evidence around the test is poor and weak at the moment and needs to be improved. Professor Alison Pollock, Clinical Professor of Public Health, University of Newcastle, told reporters. SpaceX rocket launches four astronauts to space station. Tech billionaire Elon Musk's private aerospace company, SpaceX reached another milestone when its Falcon 9 rocket propelled the Crew Dragon spacecraft with four astronauts into orbit, becoming the first NASA-certified commercial human spacecraft system in history. Two NSCN KK Nikki Sumi cadres apprehended in Purna Bazar, Dimapur. Security forces in an operation apprehended two cadres of NSCN K Nikki Sumi at General Area Purna Bazar, Dimapur on November 13, 2020. A press release from the PRO HQ IGAR North on November 16 said that security forces launched an operation based on specific input and apprehended two cadres of NSCN K Nikki Sumi while carrying out extortion. DIPR sealed for 48 hours from Monday. In view of the detection of COVID-19 positive cases, the Directorate of Information and Public Relations Koima Nagaland has been declared as a sealed area from Monday, November 16, 2020, to November 18, 2020. For a period of 48 hours, a DIPR report said. This was ordered as per the guidelines of preventive measures to contain the spread of COVID-19 in workplace setting issued by the Ministry of Health and Family Welfare. Directorate General of Health Services, Government of India, 
dated June 4th, 2020. That's all for now. To get such latest news, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you.